Hello. <clears throat> hey, everybody. Guys, been up to anything new? Guys, anything new going on with you guys? Me neither. <clears throat> um, I'll try to give you a quick like rundown, and then um, I'll I'll, I'll answer questions. I will answer questions. Uh, uh. Shit, man, I'm a little nervous. Um. I sure hope I don't get emotional, man. I really do. But y'all got to understand that, like, this is like, uh, All Out Show was, All Out Show was, that's all I've been doing the last 20 years. And I want y'all to understand something else. The All Out Show is the Jude show. That's it. Every fucking, everything... I thought of everything, every single thing, I, it, it all came from here. Even the bits that I wasn't in, I thought of, and I really cared, I cared deeply about the show. I cared about it till the end. Um... It's, uh, you know, like, I get out, I, I had ups and downs. I had ups and downs with the show. A lot of people, a lot of people think that I, like, I lost my, like, the show lost its thing because I came to Detroit and stopped giving a fuck, but it, that wasn't really the case. Um, I came to Detroit and I lost a lot of control of my own show. I, I couldn't, uh, the way things, the way things are set up out here is, uh, I, I don't see the calls. I can't control nothing. And, um, just that day-to-day -day interaction really made it hard, really made it hard, uh, to do the show, to do the show from here if, if we're not all on the same page. Um... So I think I think a lot of people would be like, oh yeah, he stopped. It was like, no, I actually cared a lot, and I just didn't want to be fucking arguing all the goddamn time with everybody working with me. So there's a, there was just I would just start picking my battles. Um. So the way the way radio goes. The way, the way radio goes is uh, serious. You do you, you do your uh, your contract. They do a contract like once every couple years, and since COVID hit, I went from having six people to one guy and one part time guy. And the show was suffering, like, yo, I can't, like, we need people to answer phones, we need, we need all this, we need, we need a bunch of stuff, like, we need people to answer phones, I need people to book guests, we, fuck, man, we were not organized for shit, you know, like, we just, we, uh, we needed help, and look, man, I'm on radio, so that shit's dying, and 
not to mention it's just like you know i've always been like the redheaded stepchild of the fucking channel so i uh the way what i did was i negotiate i was trying to negotiate to get keenan keenan hired hired on full time so that I could have another full-time guy on the show. Not because, like, you know, not because I'm a nice guy. It's because I'm selfish and I wanted Keenan to be doing full-time shit on the, on the show. Because uh, the show lacked production. I think what a lot of people don't, they fail to remember is... Um, like John and I had, we, we had issues with one another cause I wasn't crazy about him as a producer, but I also understand how serious works and it's just like, they just don't, they don't give a fuck. They just don't care. Uh, they don't care. They just want you to go do your job. Shut the fuck up. As a matter of fact. It's probably like, like people being mediocre is probably a good thing to them because it's just like one less thing they got to pay for. So when I saw that I was, that I, when I saw that John and I were stuck together, I was like, well, fuck it, man. I got like, I got it. I got it. We got to do something. And so that's when we were just like, yo, that's when I came up with the, like John being the corniest dude in radio bit. So that's how John got on there. Just because the production. I, what am I going to do? Even when Sear left. Like. Which I don't, when Sear left. They fucking. I didn't know Sear was leaving. I re-signed. I re-signed. And they were like. Oh by the way. Sear has gone. I'm like what the fuck is this? So. I've been getting kind of blindsided in different ways by Sirius over and over and over again. This one, this one hurt because this one hurt because uh, if the there's three of us, there's three of us there. There's three of us there. And I need to know what's going on. And um, I just didn't. I didn't know what was happening. So, so like, uh, yeah, man. So that's kind of, that's kind of like, that's kind of what happened. Like, the 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 show the show we 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 kept losing people um fucking we kept losing people i was getting mad about it like i was mad on the air like i was mad that i i was mad that we were losing people you know like not getting help uh the three of us weren't on the same page john john uh keenan and i clearly and i was just man i was when i got uh when 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 i found out that i like what i was negotiating for had already been done and like i was riding for these dudes you know and I don't know if they, I don't know if it was on purpose or not. Like it just, I don't know if it was on purpose or not. It, and to, at the end of the day, it doesn't fucking matter. It's like, yo, I think a lot of people don't understand like, oh, he's, you know, a lot of times I was just talking about shit because it's like, I was talking about shit because I can't, I couldn't see the fucking phone calls and 
there's been times where phone like I didn't trust I didn't trust who was go, getting on the air. Like I don't like yo I can't have like hot topics and then not be and like be getting blindsided about who's coming on the air. So all right, man, I'm gonna talk about cooking. That ain't gonna bum nobody out. So that's it. Uh, yeah, so as soon as I left, as soon as I left LA, yeah, that was it. Fork in it style. Fork in it style. And like, it, like, let's be real, like my dad died. There was a bunch of shit going on personally over here. Shit, I don't know, y'all remember I fucking almost lost my voice for like six months from eating pussy. Like, I'm showing up every day, like, trying to, that, that, trying to talk with a fucking, uh, my vocal cord, vocal cord was uh, paralyzed. So, it's been a rough one out here. Um, and that's kind of what happened, man. That's what happened. Um, I just lost control of the show. And, uh, I was trying to, I was trying to, like, regain that shit just to, just just to be like, all right, like, this is what's going on. I, I didn't even realize what was going on. And I was trying to, I, I was, I was a bit blindsided. I didn't like this spring. I didn't, I didn't show up like, oh yeah, I'm quitting serious. Oh no. This spring, I didn't show up like, yo, I'm quitting serious. I showed up like, yo, all right, man, let me do this to tighten, let me do this to tighten it up. Let me do that to tighten it up. I, like, really, think about this. Like, I like, I've written three fucking books. I care about what I do. I care. I'm not just like trying to, oh, fuck it. Da, da, da. Like, this, this is never, this was never a paycheck. This was never a paycheck. And when I found out it was out of my, I, I couldn't do shit. Like, what the fuck did I do? I was like, all right, man. Like, I got it. I'll, I'll leave. Give me a chance. Give me a chance to leave. When I figured out I couldn't do nothing, when I figured out I couldn't run my own show, I was just like, give me a chance to try to tighten it up and leave. And that's what I proposed to them. And then that was, that they uh, they were like, yeah, cool, cool, cool. And then they weren't like, cool, cool, cool. All right, so that's, there it is. I, uh, so I'm disappointed. Uh, I'm just, I'm disappointed. And my plans are, I guess I'm going to keep going, you know, like that's it. Um, I guess I'm gonna keep going. Look, I don't, and I can't do a fucking show if I'm, if I'm working with, if, if there's three of us and I can't, I can't do a show if two of the dudes I'm working with are looking at me dead in my face and not telling me the truth. That's it. That was it. All right, I'll, let me read. I don't. I don't even know. How do I? How do I get this? I don't even. Do I scroll up or down? I'm so. I'm so fucking from the fucking. Do I scroll down or up? Do I go this way to get to or go this way? Do I go this way? And that's the other thing too. It's just like, look, man. It was getting to the point where it's like, I don't know if motherfuckers, I, I don't know if like cats ain't booking people because they don't feel like booking people or they're not booking people because they're not, you know, you know, because they're not good at their job. The way, the way I looked at it was like, you know, these motherfuckers took everything from the show and then complained that the show ain't what it used to be. Like no fucking shit. I can no longer give y'all a fucking 100% quality product. All right, man, I'm out. Just give me a chance to like stack bread. 
like I, I'm taking care of my like like I'm got I'm paying on my mom's house and shit. Like yo, like I just I was just really trying to I, honestly, man. I just I was just trying to find a nice way out for everybody. And uh apparently I didn't because here I am. There was three people on the show. The show is no longer. And one person no longer works for Sirius. And there was like weird writing on the wall and shit that I didn't even like. Ugh. Like it was just weird writing on the wall, but what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, man? Y'all like I can't even be mad. Y'all heard me mad. I was mad on the air for the last couple months, man. Like you heard me mad on the air because I'm like just trying to fucking figure shit out. I'm not mad, no, like I'm just like, hey, like what what are you gonna do? What do you, I, like, y'all got to hear me be mad, man. Y'all got to hear me be mad. I'm not mad. I don't want no bad on nobody. Um, I don't know. If, I don't know if how this shit went down was on purpose or not. I would like to think that, like. It wasn't, you know, I, I, I would, I, I, I hope it was just, man, I hope it was just negligent, you know, like, I would come out of pocket for, like, I come, I come out of my own pocket for these dudes, and like, they knew I was taking care of my mom. So, for them, and it's like, yo, man, like. We could have we could have pivoted, you know. Like I, I don't think they would do me like that. I sure hope they wouldn't have. I sure hope they wouldn't have. All right, man. Um, can y'all tell? Can someone tell me which way I gotta go to get to the to the bottom? All right, it's hold on. Golly, I'm fucking stupid. I'm gonna. Hey, this is one. Let me just say this too, man. Like, I y'all don't even understand how much. Uh, I didn't say this yet, and I probably should have led with it. But I'm so. You know why I didn't say it? Because it's gonna. I'm gonna tear up. But I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful that I had a chance to do this. I made so many friends from the listeners. I learned so much. I'm so fucking grateful, man. Honestly, honestly, I'm so grateful. I'm thinking of all the people I got to meet, my heroes. I, I'm grateful, man. Look at this shit, man. Look at this. I was in a fucking, I was in a studio apartment, man. I was in a studio apartment, man. And this shit ain't paid off when I got here, you know? So, like... I'm grateful. I don't know how to do this, man. Let me, uh, yeah. All right. Shit, man, I'm tearing up. It's like 20 years you've been doing some shit, you know? It's 20 fucking years. I grew up on this, man. 
I grew up on this shit. All right. So, uh, I can't even, um, and like, look, hey, guess what? I know how science works. I'm going to go to a podcast. I don't need to hear that shit unless you Spotify and Spotify wants to sign me. Um, but like, I get it. I get it, man. I, I know what I need to do next. Unless you, unless you got a check, don't tell me what I need to do next. All right. Uh, are there any questions? Uh, shout out to Chico. I've been trying to smoke this fucking cigarette for the last fucking... How long I've been on here for? Did you get fired or did you quit? I, um... I, I talked to Paul and I was like, Hey, man. Like, clearly... I'm not like your rap guy anymore. And uh, I don't think y'all are happy. And I can't really, I can't, I, I talk, I, I was like, look, man, I'm not your rap dude no more. Y'all ain't really happy with me. Uh, and we're so far gone that I can't, I can't change the show, you know? I can't change the show. But. I'm kind of blindsided by it, so can I, like, just, like, give me, like, let me just fucking get this, let me, let me get my 20 years, fucking do this shit, and, uh, bow out gracefully, I, put me out the pasture, um, so, I just thought that was what was gonna happen, seemed like, it seemed like a reasonable thing, and, uh, it just, it just didn't, um, it it just didn't go down that way. And it's like, look, man, th and this is the this is a tough thing about Shade, right? Because Paul Rosenberg ain't with serious. So he don't write my checks. So it's just like we've there's always been this weird thing of like who knows what, like who knows what? Who who uh, who's your boss? We don't know. I think I'm going to do a, I'll probably do like, um, there's a bunch of different dudes that want to work with me. So I'll probably be doing a bunch of different podcasts. I can't see myself just doing one fucking podcast a week. I'll fucking go crazy. I'm going to, I'm going to get myself, I'll probably give myself a couple days just to be a total fucking, uh, a total piece of shit. And, uh. I'll give myself a couple of days to be a piece of shit. And then I'll I'll get up and uh get going. I spoke to John and Keenan the night that I got fired. Or I didn't get fired. The the night they decided to not fucking re-sign me. That's that's the way they do it. They don't fire you, they just don't re-sign you. Uh I spoke to them that I spoke to them then. I thank them. I asked for my passwords for, for the all out show shit. Uh, and that's that. Yeah, they gave me a severance package. Is it like, uh, is it? Am I happy about it? Nah, I'd rather just have a fucking job. I'd rather have a fucking job. And, uh, so yeah. But, hey. Just don't go crazy. I'm not, honestly, I'm not gonna go crazy. I'm not gonna go crazy. So. I got uh Keenan I don't have the password to I don't have I don't have the password to Instagram. Yeah, they they took all off they they took the show off the app. Like that's the shit that that's the shit that I don't understand, right? That's the shit I don't get, right? I don't understand why they fucking like I don't un, like I don't understand why it just seems like 
I, like I don't I'm not mad at serious. Like why like why would they why would they uh I, I don't understand why they took me off the app. I, yeah, I don't understand why they took me off the app. People were like, "What happened to you?" I was like, "What are you talking about?" They also they also offered me a chance to uh they offered me a chance to say, I think this is actually now that I think about it, it's, they offered me a chance to say my goodbye. They offered me a chance to say my goodbye, which was like they would let me tape something and then they would they would let me tape something and then uh, fucking they would air it. Based on all the shit that just went down with me, do you really think I trust anybody to fucking tape some of my words and air it? No, 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 no. Not doing that. So I think I think when uh I think I think when I did that, they kind of was like, alright, well fuck him, and then psh, he gone. So all right, let's see. I don't get paid royalties. This, like, my job was like a my job was like a factory job. You just go to work it like, you just go to work and then you, um. Why do you not talk to Who Kid? I reached out to Who Kid. Like I, I reached out to Who Kid when when uh when I had a meeting with Paul. I, yeah, I I reached out to Who Kid. He never got back to me. Um. So like that's the thing. Like that was the thing. Like I I think I think way more people understood what was going on around me than than I did. Uh, here's the other thing. My show actually no. My show my show my show is quite fucking. Uh, my show is. My show is quite popular. Um, I hit up Sway. I hit up Sway. Um, and he sent me a nice text. So that was cool. So yeah. Um, I didn't talk to Eminem. Paul gave me, Paul called me personally before, before they fired me. Bro, yo, they, yo, man, yo, I got fired by like this new boss that I, I've i never even met face to face and bro, bro, uh, his cell phone kept dropping in the middle of them trying to fire me, dog. They had to call back. I'm like, can you just fucking, can you do this from a landline, please? <laughs> Like, can you please do this from a... Do you know where the show is ranked as, at as far as say 45? What do you guys think? Come on, man. We was it. We were it. I got fired on my day off. I know I was laughing about that shit. I was like, hell no, this is just like Friday. I got fired on my fucking day off. <laughs> like who does that? I was like, for real. They tell me, and then they're like, and then you can do this, and then this is gonna happen, and then you're gonna have to look at this. And I was like, I'm I'm about to hop on a plane, yo. Like I'm like y'all couldn't just. It just happened. It just so happened that like my my uh the way they do that shit, the way they do it is, they wait they wait right for when you're um. They wait, wait right for when your contract's up, and then they just don't renew you. So, basically, when they were like, yeah, 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 we just need to figure shit out. We, oh, we just need to figure it out. We've never had anybody leave before, and uh, uh, we got to figure it out. Just hold tight. I was like, okay, sure. And I was, then I was like, wait, hold on a second. Wait, hold up a sec. Like, hmm. 
What do they got to get ready for? They got a whole year to get ready for me. Just saying, go, like, I'm just saying I'm leaving. And I'm, like, it'll be. No, nah, that, that wasn't it. They was like, as soon as I, as soon as I was like, hey, man, let me, let me leave after this year. They was like, they were like, peace. And let's be real. They probably, they, I probably bought myself some time. I probably bought brought myself bought myself some time just by coming up with that idea. Let's be all the way real. Let's keep it a buck. Mm, mm, mm. And like, look, bro. I understand, I understand, uh, I understand, I get, I get the company's position. You know, I get it. I understand it. I get, I get the position. I get it. That's not a zip yeah. What, uh, and look, yeah. It's not a Zippo. Uh, took Mayweather 15 years, but he finally did it. He finally got me. I was thinking about that shit. You know how, like, John always be like, that guy was mean to me. But I waited. Like, I wonder if, like, uh, I, want, I wonder if, if I'm going to be one of those stories, you know? I wonder if I'm going to be one of those stories. It's, hey, look, man. I've been I've been scrapping before serious. I scrapped all the way through serious. And I'll scrap over here after serious. Like that's it. Like that's all, all I know how to do is scrap. That's it. And like I had to, I had I had this I I just I was like, man, I'm not going to fucking, I'm not going to sit here and just lie, dog. I'm not going to sit here and just lie. So worst case scenario, like what, what do you, it came down to this. I was like, look, bro, I'll rather fucking bag groceries than, than have lies coming out of my fucking head. And I might end up bagging groceries. I get it. Like I might end up bagging groceries. I might have to sell everything. I might lose everything, but I'm not going to fucking lie. And I might be wrong, but I ain't going to lie. So there it is. Um, DJ Who Kid unfollowed me. I didn't know he ever did. Did DJ Who Kid you? Did DJ Who Kid ever follow me? I didn't know who kid. Fo I didn't know who kid f followed me in the first place to unfollow me. John unfollowed me too. Okay, I mean, Jesus Christ, bro. Uh, all right, okay. All right, there you go. There you go. That's crazy. How can we can how can we support you as a, like right now? I don't even know. I don't even know. I ain't gonna start no fucking GoFundMe or no shit like that. Um, I ain't got to, yeah, I ain't got to start no GoFundMe or nothing like, or nothing like that. I'll figure it out. Uh, yeah, I guess you could buy, you could buy Finn. Buy, buy the book, buy Finn. There might be some mistakes in there. 
some sp spelling errors and shit. I tried to fix it, but I don't know if it got fixed or not. Like, I don't know how to do computer shit. But, yeah, I don't know. For, for whatever, uh, oh, John follows my old account. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, yeah, that's what I mean. Like, the, even with this, John, stop following me. He's not going to do that. Da, da, da. I don't, look, y'all, hey, it, do, it doesn't matter. It, do, it fucking doesn't, like, it don't matter, man. It, it doesn't fucking matter. But I, I just want y'all to know, like, I want y'all to, like, this out, I, I was, my one thing was just a fucking, my one thing, I didn't ask for no more money. I just wanted more help on the show because I wanted to do a better show. And it just felt like they were whittling me down. I felt like I was getting stabbed up and then they're like, yo, why, why, you, why is there blood all over the place? It's like, motherfucker, like, yo, I'm just, that's it. So there you go. And like, and yeah. Yeah. It, yeah, it was just like, hey man. Like, like, they just kept taking away. They just kept taking shit away. And, and I, I don't want nothing to be, like I, like I take pride in what I do, man. So that's, that's it. I take pride in what I do. Uh, yeah, <laughs> you remember? Hey, Y'all remember me going on the show saying I did not quit? I saw it coming. So I feel like COVID put the show on life support. It did. We lost. We lost three. We lost three fucking people. We lost three people, and then and y'all gotta understand is like. I couldn't, I couldn't, couldn't, I couldn't control my own show from here, from here. And I really, I really, and I, I, I I'm happy about what I did, man. Ah, <sighs> uh, ba 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 ba. If it was up to you, would you and Sarah stay together? Yeah, like I didn't, I wasn't, I didn't, I wasn't the one that like, I wasn't the one that wanted to get to break up with Sear. Yeah, if John was sick, there was no show. They they whittled me down so much that I couldn't do shit. I I just couldn't do shit. Like, yeah, so. Are you regretting moving back home? Nah, man. No. Nah, man. Uh, things play out the way they play out. You know what are you going to do? Um, they just... Yeah, things play out the way they're going to play out. You... Yeah, man. And like, I want to thank everybody that ever worked on the show. There's so many, there's so many people that like, just, I just like, everybody from, and everybody that I, like, yo man, I got to talk, I got to be, I got to make friends with Scarface, man. I got to, I got to, uh, I got to stay, I got to make friends with Scarface. I got to, I got to meet E-40, man. I remember the first day I flew out there to New York. I got to meet Dana Dane. Like, I, 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 I has Chris Chris reached out? Yeah, man. Yeah, like, yeah, man. Yeah, Chris reached out. Like, yeah, man. Like, 
The people that fuck with me re reached out. And I don't want to and I, and I don't want to focus on who didn't reach out, you know? Like it is what it is. I think that's a good I think that's a good time to say it is what it is. It's like, you know, what are you going to do, man? I can't make people like me. Uh, ba ba ba. Yeah, call Spotify. I know, bro. That they all, that Spotify thing would be a fucking that'd be a fucking ill flex. That would be an ill flex if I just ended up on Spotify. Um, all right. Look. Go be Eminem's butler. Like my man Godfrey. We never got to call in. But, but. Yeah, like... And here's the other thing too, man. There was a lot of shit that was out of my hands on the show that I was just getting blamed for. And uh, that's not good. That's not good. So, I think, I think, yeah, I think it was probably best that I, I bail. All right. Um, is there a not NDA? There probably is. I haven't even looked at it yet. I got a lawyer looking at some shit. I got a, I got I got an attorney looking at it for me. Will we still be hearing John on on the show on Who Kid? Probably. John and Keenan still work at Sirius. I do not still work at Sirius. So. Top five guests in my career, um, like rappers, I just loved, I, you know, me and Scarface, we always, we got along really great. Uh, I liked all those conspiracy theory dudes. Yeah, I don't know. There's just there's so many. I like that. I like that. I was able to like bring in like, for instance, I, I like that. I was able to bring in a literacy expert and and have a literacy expert talk about reading on the fucking on a hip hop channel. I like that shit. Um, but you know. That's probably what they didn't like. So I get it, man. I'm not. I'm not even a. I don't. Re, I don't regret anything. Listen to me. I don't regret shit. I don't regret anything, man. Nothing. Nada. I don't know how to do anything on this. On the computer, they want me to enable badges. I don't even know what the fuck that means, y'all. Who's taking my slot? I don't know. Hey, Elk Jane, what up, man? So it's like, yeah, like I got, I started a chess club, man. Like I thought that was pretty cool, man. I started a chess club. That was neat. Uh, e. Badges would be supporting and essentially subscribing to you and paying for it. Oh, I don't need shit. I got none. I got nothing to charge y'all for right now, man. I got nothing to charge. I got nothing to charge. I don't. I don't know how to fucking. 
look, man, I, I don't got anything to charge y'all for. Yeah, you've grown so much over the years. That's it. Like, I started 20 years ago, man. I started, I started 20 years ago. So, and I'm, I'm interested in things. Like, I'm genuinely interested in shit. So, it's just like, I, I understand. I understand why, like, I could understand why they wouldn't want me there. Look, and I'm down to sell everybody things. Trust me. Like, I'm down to sell everybody things. I got no, I got no stream, I got no income stream right now, but like, I ain't like I ain't gonna start begging. No, that's not me. That's not my style. So Yeah. Uh so I don't I don't know. Uh I really appreciate all of y'all. Like you guys don't even understand, man. I'm tearing up. Hold up, man. I'm working on being stoic. I appreciate all of y'all. Like, so much music I learned from all y'all. So much food, dishes. Like, I got so much culture just from fucking talking to the listeners, man. Smokey Robinson interview, that I love that interview. And you know why I love that interview? Because I interviewed him once before and shit the bed. I shit the bed. So to get that one back, I was like, ugh. It meant so much to me, man. Uh... So I probably I'm gonna sit my ass down for like a week or something probably and then figure it out because like I said yeah fucking yeah Vicente Fernandez bro I still I'll be playing El Rey fucking driving around in the car like uh that's on my Saturday mix that's on my Saturday mix. Yeah, so that's it. Um, I appreciate everybody that fucked with me from day one. Please, please believe it. And uh, I don't know, man. I think I'm going to... Yeah, I did an hour. So I I guess I'm going to bail. But um, I'll probably be doing more lives here. I was looking at some fella... That he just like videotapes himself and puts that shit up on YouTube or something like that. Maybe I'll do that. I look, and here's the thing, man. Like I don't have like people are talking about my pill mixes and this, that, and the third. That's the other thing. I got nothing. I got nada. Clearly, I wasn't planning for this. I got fucking nothing. I got no pill mixes. I got no fucking. I got no. I got no interviews. I got nothing. So, if y'all got yo, please. If you got if you got pill mixes on my, upload them, man. Upload them, bitches, please. Yeah, like. Yeah, yeah. Me, uh, me going, me going to Michigan did fuck up like the music stuff. I couldn't do the music. There was so much stuff I just couldn't do. Um, there was just a lot of shit that I just could not do that I did that I didn't realize when I came out to Michigan, and it it did affect the show. It affected it in a negative way, and that and that's kind of like so we needed to like. We need to tighten it up over on other on other things, and it just you know, it, it just didn't go that way. How's your mom doing, man? Yeah, like th- those are those are the tough that like.
Are you there? Guess who that, do you know who that was? That was Santa Claus. That was the Santa, that I'm like, that was Santa Claus that I'm, I'm uh, that I'm, I'm fucking hiring. Santa Claus just called me. Yeah, like that's, th- those are the stuff, those are the tough shits. It's like t- telling my mom like, hey ma, might have to fucking sell the house. That's not good. Um, so there you go. Uh, but th- but then when you come to terms, but, but then when you come to terms with that, it's like it's just things. This is just things. This is just this is just a bunch of fucking things. So what are you gonna do? Why the house? Because I paid for the house. Yeah, man. Yeah, like, yeah, they... Look, bro, I don't even think... Here's the thing. I don't... I don't... I don't think this was like a giant conspiracy. I think... I think they just did their thing and let shit go the way it was gonna go. That was it. Uh, all right. Um, do a GoFundMe for your mom's house. I'll never, never. Don't you know? Like, I, I would never do that. I'm not doing a GoFundMe for my mother's home. No, man. No. <laughs> Nah, man. Uh, make your next move. Your Jay Holler, man. What up? Look, bro. You, come on, man. Uh, yeah. Are you good? Oh, fuck. As good as I could be. You know, like... Fox News is hiring. Fox is controlled out. Got to get me through a lot of tough days. Not going to lie, bro. I hope so, man. I Like, I hope, yeah, I hope that, yeah, I hope, I hope I did get some people through, through uh, tough days. So there you go. I think I think that um, I think that kind of cleared shit up. I, I think I gave everybody a decent idea about uh, about what's going on. Uh, so. Uh, <laughs> But I'll tell you this, man, just like this dude told this dude, uh, a guy I look up to, a guy I look up to, um, he told me, he was like, you, you never, never fuck with a man's money, man. You don't fuck with a man's money. That's some bitch shit. You just don't fuck with a man's money, whether you like him or not. You don't like. Because that guy has other other people dependent on him, so like that's that's the way I that's the way I approach things. I don't fuck with people's cash. I might not like you. I might talk shit, but I don't, I never try to get people fired or canceled or none of that. And um, I think I hope I hope I hope 
if some of y'all like ask for people to be canceled or shit like, like yo bro like don't do that man that's some that's some bitch ass shit that's just lame man Just worry about your own thing, man. Worry about your own thing. Uh, give me a week or so. I, I I called my cousin and asked him about science shit. So there it is. Moses, what up, man? Uh... Yeah, it's bittersweet. I really, I really, uh, yeah. So that's that. How do we work together, bro? I don't know, man. It's just, uh, fucking, um, hit my DMs or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Do I think people knew I was getting fired before I knew I was getting fired? Fuck yeah. Yep. A thousand percent. Does it matter? Nope. Don't matter. It's happened, it's happened. And I know a lot of people are not gonna believe me, but I want I wish success to I wish to success to everybody I dealt with. Everybody. I wish to success to everybody. Because it's like when people are happy, everyone's happy. You know what I mean? Like it's like if you're happy, it's like if someone's just We don't need any more bitter fucking we don't need no more bitter people. In this world, man. So I wish the best for everybody, man. All right. I love y'all. Um, I got to figure it out. And I, I, I hope I can figure out how to post this fucking thing. Because you know me. He done. Raise your hand if you cancel your prescription subscription. Yeah, if, yeah. Raise your hand if you if you cancel the per, per, sub, per, sub per, You know what the f- subscription. Um. Yeah, man. Like some of my closest friends I know from the fucking show. Jackie canceled it for her dad, too. (laughs) Hey, my mom was fucking happy as hell. My mom was so happy that everybody was canceling. She was so happy. Hey, Hannah. Yeah, man. Like... I want y'all to know something like I lost family members because I think the way I think a lot. I, I, I lost money because I think the way I think you're not changing my mind. You're just not. You're not changing my mind. And it's painful, but I'll be, I'll, I'd rather be in pain because there's nothing more, there's nothing more fucking painful than being some hollowed out motherfucker living a lie, dog. Not doing that, man. I would have liked to have gotten to 20 years, didn't get there. I tried my best, y'all. And, uh. 
Got that. That's that. Okay, now I now I'm gone. Hold up, what's up? Hey. Alright. Bye y'all. I just hit X. Well that I, I just want to be able to save the thing. If I hit X, it'll go to save. Look, man, uh just buy the book. Buy Finn. That's the one that's the only book I get paid off of. Everybody everybody else. Yeah, that's all Finn's the only book I'm really getting paid off of. So you can buy Finn if if that's what if that's what you want to do. I think it's a I think it's a great book. And it's uh that's that's it, man. Yes. All right. Um, the cookbook's coming too, y'all. How to be human. A reminder. All right. Bye-bye.